beautiful beings! Welcome and welcome back to my channel. I'm Caitlin, and for today's Christmas video, we are going to be doing a little Christmas self-care. So I love doing these self-care videos for you guys, self-love, self-care, because I hope it inspires you guys to do the same for yourself. So let's get right into this video. <laughs> I didn't want to put full like PJs on because I'm wearing these all day and I have to go run errands later. So I was like, let's try and make it kind of, um, I was like, let's try to make it kind of not like that pajama-y, if that makes sense. I don't know, it feels kind of weird. I think a big red t-shirt would look better. Okay, so much better. So when I got these, I thought they were like baggy, like flowy, like my other PJ pants. Um, but they're like tight, so they're kind of like leggings, so actually I'm going to untuck this. I think it'll be better like this, I think so, maybe with a little coat on top. And then I have my socks, the candy cane socks I got at TJ Maxx. Um, I'll give you guys an outfit of the day right now. Okay, so the shirt is from Walmart, the pants are from TJ Maxx, and the socks are from TJ Maxx. So I was like... Why? I decided to do a montage because I was like, you guys have seen me do my routine so many times. Nothing really changes. The only thing I did different today was in my bubble bath. I used bubble bath instead of essential oils and stuff. So, and I used like gingerbread man and stuff. So, that was the only different thing. And we listened to Christmas music because this is like Christmas self-care. Um, but honestly, I wanted to make this video too. Just like talk to you guys. Maybe you guys could do some self-care with me. Things like that. But yeah, I just wanted to do this to do all Christmassy stuff. Because I was going to do this anyway, so I was like, might as well film it. But if you guys want to see like more in depth, you guys go check up the little things I link up above. I'll link all my other self-love routines and talking about self-love and things like that. So, do you guys think this will match better? Because like I have like, you know, or should I get a white headband? I feel like a white headband would look better. I feel like a white one would look better. Just because there's not as much white, you know? We're going to do a honey mask. I have lots of things to do today, but I was like, I'm going on a camping trip this weekend, so I really need to take care of my skin before I go to the desert. So, my skin has actually been feeling really smooth lately. But we're just going to do a honey mask, and then we'll put on some oils, and then I'll do a little bit of makeup and talk to you guys. So let's go put on our honey mask. Okay, guys, you might see clothes right there. That are, those are the clothes I'm packing for my camping trip. So I just have my honey right here, and I'm just going to start putting it on my face. You guys know I'm like the honey mask queen. We love honey masks over here. Oh my gosh, it feels so good. Honey is so good for you. Anyways, I just hope that this vlogmas that I'm making you guys is like truly bringing some holiday spirit into your life. I know that winter can be like a very hard time for some people. Um, and holidays can be a hard time for some people. And don't worry, everybody like struggles, even if they're not showing it. There's some struggles in people's lives. And I just wanted to send you guys love because if you're able to watch this, like, it's like us doing stuff together, and I really like that. So, I hope you guys are having an amazing December so far. And I hope you guys are enjoying the videos. I have so many ideas. I wrote them down. I'm just not sure what order they're really going to go in yet. But I already have right now is 
Daisy. I just posted Vlogmas number two today. I already have the whole week planned out. So that makes me really excited because I'm really excited for you guys to watch. There's just so much happening in the world right now and I feel like I always say that. But I just wish I could like talk about it and not get and not get my channel flagged or something like that. And I'm just like too scared to. But I'm just like too scared to get flagged because I love you guys and I don't want my channel to go away. And things like that. But honestly, all these bad... If you guys know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Like all these false red flags, if you know what I mean. All these bad things are happening because of like... Oh, I just wish... I, I wonder if some of you guys know what I'm kind of talking about. I know some of you do, but I want you guys to be safe, and I want you guys to not be sheep. I don't want you just to follow what the crowd is doing. I want you guys to actually know the knowledge before you decide on something. I want you guys to, like, just be safe out there. Keep manifest for the world to be a happy place and a free place and things like that. And just always know that no matter all this bad stuff happening that is thrown in our faces and not a lot of us know just know that just know all these bad things that are happening and just when you're awake and you see all these things and you're like oh my gosh how are people not seeing this just know one by one everyone else is waking up as well and all these bad things are happening right in our face but remember evil never wins love always wins so evil is fear and nastiness and just ugliness it's fear fear is the lowest vibration and that's where all the hate comes from and all the evil energy comes from is fear. And all the light energy and love energy, which is like God, the universe, things like that. That is love and that always wins. Even though it might seem like the evilness and the fear is winning, it it's always gets worse before it gets better. So we just got to hang in there and do everything we can to protect ourselves and protect our loved ones and things like that. But it's going to be a good Christmas. Let's just keep the positivity, spread love, spread light, don't be mean to people. That's another thing I always tell you guys this, but I don't know if all of you are doing it, but honestly, if someone has a different opinion or is saying something different, don't go and yell at them. I see that so often on Instagram, on TikTok, on YouTube comments, like just know that everybody has a different belief and everybody has different views and that's another way of like looking at life like when someone has a different view than me i don't scream at them i try to see where they're coming from and if i can't see where they're coming from be like i love that you have that opinion but i, I kind of just listen to them and see try to see where they're coming from but honestly like it just hurts my heart when people yell at each other even if people are yelling at each other like if the person that I agree with is yelling at the person that I don't agree with because they don't agree with us. I'm mad at that person that's yelling at them. Do you know what I mean? So you just want to spread love, spread light, spread holiday cheer, things like that. Do your honey masks. Give some love and kindness into your body if you are doing those kinds of things. Um, and sometimes people do it subconsciously. Like, you don't know you're doing it because you think you're doing the right thing. You know what I mean? You think you're doing the right thing, but honestly, like, but honestly, it's just, like, better to keep your calm and keep your quiet and listen instead of just, bah, like, attacking. So I'm going to let this sit for a little bit. Doesn't this look so cute? So that's all I have to say about that, but let's start talking about some Christmas stuff. I'm going to let this sit, and then I'll come back and talk to you guys. Okay, it's been like 10 to 15 minutes. I think it's been like 10 minutes, but I'm just going to gently wipe off the honey. Let's see. I'll tell you a couple of my favorite things about Christmassy stuff, I guess. My favorite Christmas movie is Elf. I love Elf. It's so funny. My favorite one. Um, what else, what else, my favorite, I can't pick a favorite Christmas song, I love all the Christmas songs, I, I like some more than others, but I love all Christmas songs, like old ones, new ones, like I just love Christmas songs, my favorite holiday food are tamales, I love those, they're so good, we make them every year, my mom and I have been doing that for like the past three years, and then before that I would do it with my Nana's family, and they're so good, homemade, oh my gosh, I wish I could send you guys some, they're so yummy. I also love pozole. I love that. They're so good. Good food for Christmas. It's like my favorite time to eat probably more than Thanksgiving. I just like like this time of year. I love giving to people. I think I like giving more than I do receiving gifts. 
Um, I always try to make everyone's gift as thoughtful as I can. It just depends on who it is. Like, if I don't know what to get you or if you don't give me an idea, I usually try to make it as thoughtful as I can for the people I love. So, I can't wait to show you guys everybody's presents. Not all the presents are here, though. So, we're going to have to wait a little bit. But I think they'll be here. I think everyone's gift. I have a bunch under my bed right now. But I think the last person's gift that's coming is like December 19th. So, we're going to do it and then upload it all quick before it's Christmas. Or maybe I'll upload it after Christmas. So that... Even if my family sees it, it's not a big deal. We'll see. But I'll end up showing you guys. Like I said in my other video, my vlog, when I went to, to the store for Christmassy shopping. Um, but yeah, I just love this time of year. I'm so happy during this time of year. It's just so amazing when you give to someone and they're just like, Oh my God, thank you so much. Or they get emotional. Or even if they don't show emotion because they don't know how to show emotion. That's okay. I just like the feeling of giving people stuff. Like, um, I think, like, how I show love is, like, I don't know. Like, you know there's different love languages? I think, like, one of my ways is, like, um, I think one of my ways is, like, giving people gifts, but, like, I make them gifts. Like, I think I make my boyfriend a gift, like, literally, like, every two weeks. And I'm just like, I love you. Like, that's my way of showing it. Or, like, I don't know what else. I don't know. I, I like... I like, I think I'm like all five of those love languages mixed in. Like how I like to receive it and like how I give it out too. So, okay, my skin feels so good. It's a little sticky, so. I'm just going to put some vitamin C serum on and then a little bit of oil because I don't want to look all oily like I usually do at night and in the morning. So I'm just going to do a little bit of this. I swear to you guys, I have so much to talk about in my head when I'm going to make this video. When I make videos, and then I just don't. So I think I'm going to have to start writing down what I want to talk about. So I remember. Just like little bullet points, you know? That's another thing. I want to do more things on Instagram. But I need to do, like, pictures. And, like, I don't, I don't, I haven't taken pictures of myself. Like, I could take selfies, but, like, selfies get boring. I want, like, actual photo shoot pictures. So I have to make time to do that. Maybe when I go camping, but I don't know. I'm going camping with my boyfriend's family, with his dad and his siblings. And, yeah, that's where we're going. We're going to the desert. It's close to Joshua Tree National Park, which is cool. I've never been there before. Um, but, oh my gosh, didn't I just say I wasn't going to do that much oil? Oh, well. Oh, well. I'll go to the store looking like this. But I have so much to do today, guys. So I'm just kind of relaxing right now. Um, and then I have to pack, which I'm going to make a video of me packing anyways for you guys. But um, I have to pack my stuff. And then I have to go to the store and get baby wipes. Because when you camp in the desert, you need baby wipes. You know why? Because when it gets there's dirt everywhere. So you need, when you're about to go to bed, you don't want to go to bed all dirty. Especially if you're camping in a tent. Or we're we're gonna have be we're gonna be in a fifth wheel, but you know like there's not that much water on those things, and we're boondocking, which means like there's no hookups or anything. So you need to like you don't want to go to bed all dirty, or you don't want to be dirty. You'll get so much more acne than you already will. So I bring baby wipes, and before I go to sleep, I just wipe my whole body like if I were taking a shower, like not my whole whole body, but like my body that was showing, and I just take off all that dirt. And it really helps. My boyfriend was like, oh my gosh, this was such a good idea. I was like, mm-hmm. So last time we did it, which I recorded that. If you guys want to check it out, I'll link it up there as well. Um, but we're doing kind of the same thing, just in a different place. So, yeah, that's what I have to say about that. I have to go to Rite Aid. I think I'm going to go to Rite Aid and just get some baby wipes. Maybe makeup wipes instead of baby wipes. Maybe that will help with the grime better. Who knows? Um, whatever they have. So, honestly, wait, guys, this lotion, I'm so ADHD. I'm so sorry. I talk really fast sometimes, and I'm all over the place. But this lotion I was, this lotion I used, it smells good. Like, I don't, like, I didn't think I'd like how gingerbread would smell. But it smells pretty good. It smells like a, it doesn't smell like sh as strong as, like, a gingerbread, but you could, like, get the, like, hint of it. And it smells really good. I'm really glad I bought it. It was only, like, how much was it? It was like five dollars 
not bad, not bad. Same with the little shower gel, bath soap, whatever that thing. I, it was so many things. It was so many things on there, but they were only five bucks each, so I spent like ten dollars on them. Not bad. They're at TG Maxx, but this is the brand. They have lots of things on there, like they have a lot of things from that brand. I've seen it's a good brand, I guess. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do makeup. But maybe I will. Let's see. I still have this from decorating my room. Um, I think I'm just going to do a little bit of blush. This is literally my favorite blush besides the Tarte. The Tarte is my favorite too. The, the Tarte Amazonian Clay one. I love that. Let's see how this blends because I put on oil. This is great. You spray your beauty blender with the, with the Hydrating Mad Hippie Mist. Oh my gosh. I could have done more but all my self love routines are the same but you guys love these videos but I just want to talk to you guys a little bit get in the Christmas spirit go spread some love go spread some holiday cheer you know an elf and he's like the best way to spread Christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear so go sing your little hearts out it's good for your throat chakra it's good for your heart chakra it's good for everybody's chakras so if you like to sing go ahead and sing to people Honestly, I just sing in the shower or I sing in my room or in the car, but it's a good, it's good to sing. It's really good for your throat chakra. We haven't done chakra videos in a while. I'm actually like, I'm excited for Vlogmas, but I'm also like kind of missing the spiritual content. But don't worry, we'll kick it in the butt in January. And I'm going to start brainstorming for different spiritual videos too. What are you guys doing for Christmas? What are you guys doing for the holidays? What do you celebrate during the holiday season? Let me know down below in the comments. Also, what is your favorite family tradition? That is so cute. I might put that on my Instagram because that is so cute. I would love to know so that one day, I would love to know because everybody has specific traditions like mine. I like I love making tamales with my mom and the elves on the shelves and writing Santa a letter with the kids and giving Santa cookies, things like that, how we do it, how we do all that stuff. We make gingerbread houses every year. Usually when we have family over for Christmas Eve, we do an ugly sweater party. I think that's so fun. If we do that this year, which I don't know, if my boyfriend's family can come over, we'll do it with them. But if not, then we're just going to hang out. Maybe my uncle will come over. Um, but if they come over, then we'll have an ugly sweater thing, and it's going to be fun. So, okay, before we leave, like I said, I wanted to tell you guys. So, Christmas gift ideas. I might give you guys some ideas and tips on Christmas gifts. Camping vlog. I think I'm going to vlog, but who knows. I know I'll make one packing and getting ready to go there. Um, Christmas tree decorating and picking out the Christmas tree. That's a good one. I'm excited for that one. Making gingerbread houses with the kids and my family. Wrapping presents and showing you guys what I got who, you know. Essential oils for the holiday spirit. I have some blends I have to tell you guys about. Some essential oils just to get for this Christmas or next Christmas. Ice skating date. Oh my gosh, I'm going to go ice skating. Oh, and going to see Christmas lights. A house tour. I already told you guys that. And I don't know if it'll be out right now or after this video. We'll see. But yeah, I'm just really excited. I have all these written down right here. <clears throat> I'm actually going to cut right now to the next video, but I'm pretty much done with my skincare. I'm pretty much done with my little like self-love thing. I just wanted to have a shower, a good bath, and put some comfy clothes on and just really like treat myself. Of course, go ahead and do your affirmations, do meditation. I'm probably going to meditate though tonight before I go to bed. Also, self-love and self-care is all about eating healthy and eating fruit and eating things that energize your body. And oh my gosh, I love these socks. These are so cute. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But if you're watching this during Vlogmas, I am posting every weekday in December. So go ahead and put your post notifications on for that and if you guys would like go ahead and check out everything on the side right here and if you cannot find it it'll be all linked down below in the description box for you guys anyways i hope this inspired you and i can't wait to see you guys in the next video and i hope wherever you are in this world you are having a beautiful day or night bye guys